solve system of equations. I am Anil Kumar and in this example we will see how to solve system of equations which involve quadratic and linear equations. So the first equation is y equals to 2x squared. The second one is y equals to 11x plus 6. Now here we have a quadratic equation and a linear equation. Well the method used will be similar to what we used for a linear system and we will use substitution method to solve this equation. y equals to 2x squared and y equals to 11x plus 6. So I can always substitute this y as 2x squared. So I'll get 2x squared equals to 11x plus 6. Now we can bring the terms together to the left side. So we get 2x squared minus 11x minus 6 equals to 0. At this stage we can find the value of x by using quadratic formula or we can also factor it. Now factoring is not difficult here since we are looking for two numbers whose product is 6 times 2 with a negative which is minus 12. So we are looking for two numbers let's say p and q whose product is minus 12 right. So let me write I already did minus minus 12 and the sum that means p plus q should be equal to minus 11. Now the two numbers can be 12 times 1 right and since we need sum as negative we'll take plus 1. So these two numbers can help us factorize this. So we can write this equation as 2x squared minus 12x plus x. So minus 11x is minus 12x plus x minus 6 equals to 0. Now we can factor using the groups. So grouping first two terms we can take 2x common. We get x minus 6 and here we have x minus 6 equals to 0. Now x minus 6 is a common factor between the two terms. We get 2x plus 1 equals to 0. Now that gives us two different solutions, correct? So one of the solution here is, let me write down the solutions here, is when x minus 6 is 0, the other is when 2x plus 1 is 0, right? So we have two different solutions. So these two solutions are 1 when x minus 6 is equal to 0 the other one when 2x plus 1 equals to 0 you can solve for x here you get x equals to 6 and in this case we get x equals to minus 1 divided by 2 so these are the two solutions for the given system right you can also get the solution graphically so if you sketch this function for example Okay, let me just extend this line itself. Now here, 2x squared will be kind of a graph like this, a parabola which is vertically stretched. Correct? And the line 11x plus 6 means y-intercept of 6 and 11 means a steep line, right? So let me draw a very steep line here. Let's say this one, right? Now this line represents y equals to, this is y equals to 11x plus 6, correct? And the function which we have drawn here is 2x squared. As you can clearly see from the graph, there are two points where they are going to intersect. So these are the two points mentioned here. So these are two solutions for our system. So we have found the x values we should actually find the y values for these x points also to get the answer right so it is minus 0.5 and 6 so the y value for x equals to 6 will be we can calculate from this equation we can write let me continue y equals to 11 times 6 let me write 11 times 6 plus 6 right which is 12 times 6, right? 6 times 2, 12, 72. So that is the first point. The second one will be half of minus half of 11 
plus 6. So, so okay, let me write here. So, y equals to 11 times minus half plus 6, right? Minus half of 11 is 5.5, so which is minus 5.5 plus 6, and that gives you the answer of 0 0.5. And therefore, we have two solutions for this, and now we'll write down the solution. So the solution is first coordinate point is 6 and 72 and the second one is x equals to minus 0 0.5 or half and y value of 0 0.5. So these are the solutions for the given question. I hope you appreciate it. Thank you and all the best.